we got some bonus weekend material for you guys. I figured you guys love the commentary stuff. So why not go back and watch Mini Meltdown together? Um, so let's watch the intro together. Some good memories here, like some very well-built, okay, actually, to be honest, they're all shit Camrys. Like these are all mostly stock cast Camrys built with just garbage I had around, but they seem to always work. So, I was super nervous with Meltdown, yeah, guys. Ah, uh, doesn't matter to me, man. I can Look at this hair now. And look at that haircut I got there, guys. Much nicer haircut. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, man. That's that's one thing I really, really, really like about Meltdown is uh, it's sad that it's not going to be happening anymore. This year was the last year for Meltdown, unfortunately. But what I really like about Meltdown is everybody is so nice there. Like, you think Canadians are nice? Screw that. You Americans and, and well, I've only derbied in New York and Pennsylvania, but you guys are so friendly. Huh. I had people wanting to bring me coffee every morning. Yeah, I, I've never expected that before. So, we're starting up the car and heading in. Twisting together my fuel pump lines. Heading in. So, I thought I had an extra GoPro there, so I figured why not face it towards me. It doesn't last the entire derby. Shocker, right? Shocker. Everybody's getting their cameras running. Heading into the ring. I'm in the ring with some very, very tough competition. Uh... Junkyard, junkyard guy was in there. Uh, Fueled by haters was in there. Uh, Archer was it. There was some very, very, very tough drivers in this ring. So I asked him. I said, "You guys taking Mad Dogs to feature? Because that's how I got to feature last year. That's the only thing that saved me this year." And he says to me, "No." So I said, make sure you tell all these bastards that too, because I don't want the Mad Dog in me if there's no Mad Dog feature prize. So, heading into the ring, asking where he wants me. So, here we go, you guys ready? All the GoPros are on. We got back view, we got front view, we got in car. I don't know where I'm gonna put my face on this one. So, didn't really want to go for tire right off the bat, went for door. You guys can see my transmission cooler up there on the dash. <clears throat> Trying to just pick a nice spot here. So, I got tires on that I want. I got my V-treads back. They're not my normal V-treads, but they are. Actually, you know what? This is awesome because I'm wearing my Meltdown shirt. So, just picking my shots. It's early in the heat. It's going to be a slug fest. Trying not to get track shot in, trying to make the back end go up as you guys can see. When I use my back end right there against the yellow car, if you take a look at my head, I quickly peek through where my gas tank protector is to see if the reframe rails are doing what I want them to do. Always keeping an eye on my car to know what corner I should be using and how I should be using it. Just trying to keep my front end clean. Trying to do a little damage, poke shots. Sometimes you get lucky with a little poke, you know. This car right here, this gray and purple car, what a tough, tough car that thing was. This is when I realized I think I need a replica bumper. Red flag, red flag. So these replica bumpers, man, they're taking over the derby world and honestly, Meltdown was the place when I realized I needed V-treads as well. You, you, you gotta keep up with it. You gotta pay to play sometimes. But as you can see, that yellow car right there, the back of it looks like it's falling apart. So I think I found a soft car that I can hit a couple times. See? Don't want to get tangled in it, but if I can hit it a couple times and not do a lot of damage to myself, I get the hit recounted, I do damage, and I know that it's a soft car. Get my front end out of there. Don't want to wreck the front end just yet. I'm 
not in a good spot. I'm at the end of the track here. Meltdown at the end of the track, you can get slammed out of the ring so quickly that you don't want to be stuck at the end of the track at Meltdown. Getting my nose back out, back to the wall, bad spot. Get away from the wall. Meltdown, they can push you out. Driving around, choosing my shots. Not really wanting to waste the car. Motor to motor shots are not good. That's a good shot. Damage, soft, don't hit the cage. Hitting cages kind of sucks. There's that soft yellow car. Try to find a soft car in the ring, because soft cars don't hurt. You hit a hard car and you can feel a hard car the next day, but soft cars are nice to drive into the back of. Just don't get hung up on them. So I'm still driving around, picking and choosing my shots. I see 44's not looking great in the front end there. You guys, you gotta take mental notes of cars. You gotta take mental notes of where you are in the ring. You gotta take mental notes on who's after you. Stuff like that. So nobody's really started teeing off on me yet, which is nice. Red flag. Somebody starts teeing off on you, you gotta pay attention. I look to Steven right now, I think. It's been a while since I've watched these. Looking around inside the car. I think I do a little bit of commentary. Pretty nervous, guys. Pretty nervous. And here we go again. I'm getting caught up and tangled. I'm at the end of the track. I'm not super happy where I am right now. Driver's side out at least. But that doesn't stop New York, boys. They'll still take, they'll risk that shot. But I'm getting trapped here in the corners and I do not like where I'm located in this track. As you can see, I'm kind of panicked trying to get out. There, I'm out of the corner, which is nice, but I don't want to be there anymore. So just push him, get the heck out of that corner. Got somebody behind me, that's nice. You keep somebody behind you at the corner and they can't shove you out. That was a hard motor to motor shot. I felt that replica. This guy's coming for me, give him the front end so that way he won't try to take the shot. don't want to waste this car in the heat. I really do not. I want to have as much car left for the feature as I possibly can. So hitting the backs of cars is not going to kill them. They all have gas tank protectors at this show. What they're going to do is they're just going to make it so that you don't wreck your car and you don't wreck theirs. Just taking my time, picking my shots. I don't want to take the tire shot because I knew he threw door. You see that? You got to play it. He's playing it too. You got to know what they're going to do, because I would do it too. I would throw my door 100 times to protect that driver's side tire. I found a soft car again down there at the end of the track. You guys got to know the soft cars and play with the soft cars, because the soft cars are not going to hurt your car, especially the front of the Camry. Back of it, yes, not the front. Field by haters looks like he's out. Give him thumb up. He gave me thumb down, so I know that he's not good. Take a look at his tire. That's a new body Camry, guys. So again, I'm in a spot I really don't like. You take a look behind me, you can see outside the track. Now, I know the track is soft here, so I'm just waiting, because I, if I start moving, I'm just gonna dig myself a hole. I'm just waiting to try to get out without digging myself a hole and getting stuck. Make a hit, just to reset my clock, get pushed back. Don't want to dig a hole. You guys got to know where you are in the track. Red flag, red flag. Still not digging because I just don't want to get stuck. I'm getting pinned in this corner, but realistically, that gave me a minute of not being able to make shots. Come out, make a shot, reset my timer, push them around a bit. Now I'm stuck in the middle of the track. I don't want to be sideways in the middle of the track. That's how you get hurt, guys. Never be in the middle of the track. Mud is flying, you need to get the heck out of there. There's 75 again. Pushed him into the wall. Nice, 44. That was a good shot, man. Give thumbs up to the officials. Oh, he got fed back. You know what, you, oh, and 75 came back for him. That's it, guys, if you get hit, don't get angry. Don't give people the finger, just 
hit them back. That's what the sport's all about, is hitting people that you're angry with inside that ring. So, see that car right there? I really try not to mess with the back of cars like that. I say that as I drive into it, because you can get cut off on that, and you can drive into it and then get hung up on that car. And you don't want that, because then you're stuck, and nobody's gonna help you, nobody. So I'm counting the cars. I think we're down to like seven cars right now. They're taking top four to finals. So I'm seeing this guy's gas tank protector through the back of his car. Don't really want to be messing with that too, too much. So I hit the other car. Not aggressive hits, just enough to restart the timer. But I'm always trying to find out where is it everybody is in that ring. See that hit? Not a big hit, but it counts. Trying not to hit uh, field by haters in the door there, Tracy. Square hits, save your frame rails. Sorry, Tracy. Waited for him, quickly got out of the way. Good shot, and then I get him to the wall. Get him again, Zach, get him again. No, you wasted a shot. What was I thinking? I could have got a nice passenger axle shot. This is why I have no hair. I keep ripping it out watching these videos. Here I come, here I come. Nice! Passenger side tire, that's what you're after. He gave me thumbs up, buddy. That's what you need to do. I love New York, guys. Meltdown is the show. I am so sad to see it go. Spinning wheels, you guys put on one heck of a show. I've never been treated with such respect at Tech. I've never dealt with such amazingly nice people at Meltdown. Oh, she died, she died. What's she doing? You fire back up. Don't you die on me now, Camry. It's like top five. I've almost made feature. 44 is hurt in the front end. Don't want to waste it from motor to motor. That's it. Oh, they got that driver's side strut. It might have just been bumper, but... My car is getting hot. I can feel it. So I know I need to start driving more aggressively. I can feel it. Oh, big hit from Junkyard Dog there. Got him right on that passenger side strut. So, I'm gonna pause the video here. Let's take a look at this guy's rear frame on this thing. So that purple and gray car, I do not wanna mess with the back of it. And I'm gonna show you why right here. Let me get a little closer so you can see it through the front camera. So if I did a square hit to the back of this, my bumper would go underneath his trunk and his trunk would just fold down my rad support and just completely destroy the front end of my car. So you see my hood move there? I really don't want to mess with the back of that car anymore. Just because the amount of damage it's gonna to do to my upper rad support is just crazy. Missed that shot, which kind of sucked. That could have been a nice kill shot. Don't want to mess with those replica bumpers either, guys. Forty four is looking rough. The bugs are starting to get bad out here. I love watching these videos. That's the great thing about YouTube, guys. You start a YouTube channel, you videotape the stuff that you love to do, you put it up here, and then you can access it anywhere that you have cell phone service or any home computer. You can watch yourself or any of the memories you make. That's why I love YouTube, guys. Not only do I get to share, keep my memory safe, I get it so that you guys can do my memories with me. Here comes 40. Nice shot against 44. 
but I can tell my camera's getting hot. Oh, here it comes. This is a good one. Replay. Oh, the wheel fell off. I, I might need that, you know. You can see that official looking right at me going, you're a damn idiot, Zach. It was locked in the whole time. It just popped off. I'm not sure why. You can see the steam. I'm getting extremely hot here. There's six cars left. They're taking top four to feature. So we've weaseled our way down to top six. So I think this is where I gotta start, start turning it up because I know my car's getting hot. I think that shot is what hurt my frame rails really bad on this car. So trying to turn it up actually probably hurt my chances in the finals. Did you guys see that? Look at his rear C pillar. Ready? Ready? Watch this car up here. I'm going to pause it right as I hit him. Ready? So you see his rear seal pillar, C pillar on the passenger side. Boom. That's how you kill a Camry. You take the back of it out. They start dragging their back ends. They get slower. Transmission gets hotter. And then you can tee them off once they're half the speed because they can't avoid you at that point. So look at that. One big shot in the back. And he's much, much slower. Come back in. Get that rear quarter again. He's trying to start his car. So I think I'm down to top five. Just got to make top four. Got spun around, great shot, give thumbs up. I love giving thumbs up. As of right now, I think I'm making feature. I'm like, no way, no way I'm making feature. I'm asking the officials four and they're not giving me four fingers back. I was like, guys, 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 do I make feature? They're like, you just made feature. I was like, no way. I'm so excited. My goal for Meltdown this year was just to make feature and I did it. I did it guys. I made feature for the third year in a row at Meltdown. Unbelievably happy about that. They're telling us just to wait the 60 seconds to see if he gets it refired. I'm so excited. I've done it. I did it. So ecstatic. Guys, Meltdown is that one show that I, I, I just absolutely love. So excited. I need to get out, shake everybody's hand. What a derby. The catch is, the derby's not even over yet. We still have the, to fix it and then do the finals. So make sure you guys come back to see the feature. Take care, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you back here later on Zach's Workshop. Take care.